I think those all sound uh, pretty darn interesting, especially when you got to the interdimensional. I'm like, that's, yeah. uh, you never know, you never know, because if we can't prove it, we have no real uh, evidence sure. about it. How can we say it's not true? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I kind of think that's what Bigfoot is. I think Bigfoot is some kind of creature that can come in, in and out of our reality. Or it's a space alien in a space suit. Yeah, it very well could be. Very well, you never know. Yeah. It, could be, it could be one of those one or two percent that you yeah. said are real. You never know. All right, so you talked about being a pothead and, and having some issues and having recovery, and you got into uh, extreme sports and, and doing things like that. Why don't you talk about that a little bit for, for the group that's sure. here? Sure. Uh, about that whole process and of uh, rejuvenation in your life. Yeah, so you know, I got, I got sober when I was 17. Um, you know, and I was lucky to kind of fall into like a really solid group of young guys who were all getting sober at the same time and um, we were all similar ages and you know, they all went off to college and I kind of fell in, I, I got asked to do this one-off show in England and um, I went and did a bunch of rock climbing in, um, in Europe and I just kind of fell in love with the outdoors. It was, you know, I was, I was 19 at the, 18, 19 at the time and um, I somehow once again, convinced the network to hire me to go travel the world for like five years and go film a bunch of extreme sports. As I like to say, I was the first Instagram asshole before Instagram. Like, you know, you see, here's me doing awesome stuff on Instagram. Like, I was just, I somehow managed to make TV shows out of it. So it was, it was, it was amazing. Like, I traveled, I mean, I filled up two passports in five years and literally went everywhere. That's amazing. That's amazing. Yeah. 